Hello, my name is Harold York. I'm a research scientist in Pasadena, California, and I'm going to explain how to convert moles of oxygen into grams. We're talking about a chemical uh, term that means a certain number of substance. And in this case, the certain number is how many O2 molecules do we have? So, that number is 6022. Now, I would have to continue with another 20 zeros to display this number, and I'm not sure if this uh, whiteboard has enough space. So, I'm going to use scientific notation 6.022 times. 10 to the 23. So these, there are 6.022 times 10 to the 23 molecules in a mole of that particular molecule. The second term I have to define is O2. And I think I've already divulged what it is. O2 is the oxygen molecule, which consists of two atoms of oxygen that are bound together. The third term I have to define is gram. What is a gram? A gram is a metric unit, obviously, and it's defined, believe it or not, as one thousandth of a kilogram. So, it's one kilogram divided by a thousand. Now, somewhere locked up in a cabinet, they have a one kilogram mass, which is the standard, and uh, people have to use that as their uh, standard. Now, the question is, if we have a mole of oxygen gas, uh, how many grams of oxygen gas would we have? And so let's figure out, first of all, a mole means that we have this number of, of molecules, and the definition is of a mole is actually uh, the number of carbon atoms in 12 grams of carbon-12. So carbon-12 is a atom that has six protons and six neutrons in the nucleus and six electrons in the outer um, cloud, electron cloud. That is 12 grams of carbon has exactly this number of carbon atoms. We need to find out what is the atomic weight of oxygen. We know the atomic weight of carbon, it's 12. We would look that up in a table called the periodic table and look at where oxygen is and we'll find the number, I'm rounding, rounding up, it's 16. 16 grams per mole of O, but we have two of them. So we have to multiply 16 by 2, and the answer of this is there's 32 grams of oxygen in a mole of oxygen. So there's 32 grams per mole. And that's the answer to our question.